Today's topic is to find those keys which are having the duplicate values in the dictionary. There are three methods to solve this kind of a problem. First method is a basic approach. Second is by flipping them. And the third is by using a filter method. Let's start from the first method that is a basic approach. So in this method, what we're going to do is we are going to convert the dictionary values to the key using an inverse mapping. And after that, we are finding the keys. First, we have initialized a dictionary and second, an empty dictionary. After that, for finding the values, we have used a for loop that is for key and a value in our every item in the dictionary one, we are setting it into the dictionary two. We have used a set default value over here and a set method over here. So what does this set default method is going to do is it's going to return the value of a key if the key is present. If the key is not present, then we are going to add the key over here. We have used a value in the set method, which is going to make the set is used for making the elements as a distinct element. So that's what the set is used. We have over here and the value for that thing. And as I said, if the key is not present, then we are going to add them. After that, we are taking the values in our list one. That is, you need to find the keys, right? So the keys are D and B, B and C. So how we are going to find it? We have used a list comprehension over here. That is for every key and a value in our dictionary two elements. If the length of the value is greater than one, then we are going to store those values in our list number one. And after that, we are printing it out. As you can see it over here, our dictionary one comprises of B having the 20 value and D having also same value. Same goes for C and the E key values as well. So that's why we get a duplicate as D and B having the value 20 and E and C having a value 30.